first, hundreds are gathering to say their goodbyes to civil rights activist Helen Chavez. Helen Chavez, wife of Cesar Chavez, died last week here in Bakersfield. Now, over the last week, the tributes have been pouring in as people who worked with Helen Chavez and knew her, they paid their respects to the civil rights activist. Last night, hundreds showed up at the National Chavez Center in Keene for a rosary held in Chavez's honor. Mariachi bands played for guests while clergy said prayers. Carrie Kennedy, daughter of Bobby Kennedy, flew in from South Africa for the vigil. Kennedy said Helen Chavez was a woman who will be sorely missed. Chavez's funeral this morning is expected to draw some big names, and among the attendees, Carrie Kennedy, whose father, as we just said, Bobby Kennedy, marched with Helen and Cesar Chavez during the Delano grape strike in 1968. Organizers are also expecting actor Edward James Olmos, Tejano music legend Little Joe Hernandez, and former Los Angeles Archbishop Roger Mahoney. Throughout her life, Helen Chavez had the opportunity to meet many of our nation's leaders. And back in 2012, she met President Obama right here in Kern County at a ded dedication for the Chavez Monument in Keene. In a statement released by the White House following Chavez's death, President Obama called her a force of quiet strength with a legacy that will echo for generations. To read the president's full statement, head to our website at turnto23.com. One of Helen Chavez's last public appearances was last year when her husband received full military honors at his burial site in Keene. She received an American flag in the ceremony performed last April, 22 years after Caesar's death. Caesar Chavez served in the Navy from 1946 to 1948. He also had two cousins who served in the military. Both died in World War II. Stick with 23ABC as we follow today's services for Helen Chavez. All you have to do is go to our website at turnto23.com or download our mobile and tablet apps. You could find more on Chavez's life and influence on Kern County.